come come good to back half of the year and to get back out for one more game was something I'll remember forever. Why was that so important to you, Hurls? It's really just to be able to get out there one more time. I mean, a lot of guys, they retire injured or they don't get that opportunity. So why was that so important just for one last, one last show? Um, I think just over the journey, um, there's been some ups and downs and I didn't really want to finish on a, on a low, I suppose. Um, obviously, you put so much time and effort, so to, to go out being injured or, or unwell and just sort of fade off into the distance didn't really sit well with me. So I just thought, well, I'm going to give it one last crack to try and get back out there. And I guess to, to say thank you to my family, thank you to my friends, and, and thank you to this footy club that have given me uh, such an opportunity and to, to live out my, my childhood dream. Uh, I really wanted to uh, say thank you. Nick, we mentioned at the start you've always carried yourself so well and represented your footy club so well. You've had some amazing times, you've had some difficult times. What have you learned about resilience over the journey, mate? Um, I guess you, you've learned to embrace the good times as much as just work your way through the tough times. Um, I guess for me, over the 14 years, there's been some low lows, but at the same time, there's some really high highs. Um, I guess for me, just so thankful that uh, my family, my friends, uh, my teammates have been so supportive and the last 12 months, or the last 24 months, uh, have really shown that. Mate, we have a segment on this show called The Saturday Star. You are undoubtedly our Saturday star. Good luck with everything moving forward, mate. You've made so many friends in the industry. You're a superstar and Essendon fans will miss you. Thanks for joining us on Best on Ground. Well,